Hey Conifer, I'm Samantha Tilly. And I'm Logan Tilly. And welcome to this week's episode of Logo Tracks. We have a lot of exciting announcements this week. Especially for juniors and seniors, so listen close. If you need to leave school early for any reason, please finish your classes for that day remotely. You do not need to return to school. Juniors, the deadline to register for the SAT essay is Tuesday, February 16th. The essay is free this year. The SAT testing day is April 13th, and it is never too early to begin studying. Seniors, we are happy to announce that Conifer High School will be hosting a commencement ceremony on Saturday, May 22nd at 11 a.m. on Fitz Field in recognition of the graduating class of 2021. As a result of COVID-19 and Jefferson County's health guidelines, there will be limited seating. Chassa has sanctioned online gaming for sports. Mr. Watson has been chosen as a coach for our esports team and is still looking for some epic gamers to join our ranks. These games include Rocket League, Call of Duty, and Madden. Sign up is until February 15th. Let's see how Logan is coming along with his Rocket League practice. My progress is questionable. We were able to get an interview with Principal Paxton regarding lunch. Let's hear what he has to say. Where Where did our lunch go? This year has been unique in in how we've had to schedule the school year. Uh, One of the things that we have to address is the fact that we have transportation kind of restrictions that kind of guide our start of our school day and our end of our school day. And within that, we have to get the instructional hours put into the day so that we can make sure that you guys have all the seat time in class to earn the credits you get for graduation. So what we've done is within the hours that we have available to us, we also have to combine a time for lunch to be served. And so we do have lunch served as a grab-and-go lunch system, and that's because of the restrictions we're also under as far as how food can be served to students. So... Um, it's a little bit of a challenge, so they decided to put it in, in the way we serve it right now after school. Um, as far as why we have it that way and not uh, during the day is because um, if you were to do it in the classrooms, okay, how do we get the food from the cafeteria to each of the classrooms to be served? The other thing, too, is that teachers have a requirement in the contract that they have with the school district to have a 30 minute uninterrupted lunch. So the teachers wouldn't be there to supervise the kids having lunch. We'd have to have another adult like an administrator or someone else to go into the classroom. There's not enough of us to go through all the school and cover. I only have my team here. We have to cover all the classrooms in the building for lunch to be served. And so it makes it a real challenge for us to do that. We do have snacks available in the library that teachers can collect. Uh, we typically have given them out. They have a, a, a reserve of lunches. They can swing by any time to grab those things. Um, or a student can go down to the library at some point and grab that. We do have breakfast. It's grab and go in the morning that kids can grab when they come into school and take with them to the classroom to eat. Um, and uh, as far as snacks, they can, the teachers should have those available for students to snack on during the class day. And they can also bring snacks to school and have those too, so they can bring them from home and put them in their backpack. I come prepared, bring a snack with you during the day, because it is a long day and I respect that. Um, and also too, we have lunches available for all students after school. So any student who wants to get a grab or go lunch, they can swing through, grab a lunch, and, and eat it on their way to for their parents to pick them up. Or when their parents pick them up, they can take it with them. Or right, they can eat it right before they get on the buses. 
All right, folks, that seems to wrap it up for this week's episode of Lobo Tracks. Thank you so much for watching. I'm Logan Tilly. And I'm Samantha Tilly. Until next time. Stay safe, Conifer. <laughs>